where the water fill valve is, there's the tube right here that comes down and then that fills up the toilet when you flush it. Now the old style, see this white thing here? That just kind of hooks on the side of here like that and it holds this and the water comes out of the bottom. And then that fills it up. This will be assured that this is always going to stay in this position. Well, some of the older models doesn't have this white thing here. It's got a little S hook that hooks up this black tube. Let's pull this off. I can show you what I mean. Ah, I'm not being able to pull it off very easily. Maybe I should just leave it on there. Just make believe that white thing's not on there. And there's a little S hook that kind of hooks onto here. And then this tube hooks onto the side of this drain pipe like that. Or it's hooked in and this is connected and, and the water goes down that way. Okay. Either way, sometimes that S hook comes off and this black pipe could be pushed down the hole down further than the water line. So if the water line is only an inch below this pipe or half an inch, three quarters of an inch, if this pipe, this one here, this tube, if that's down in this pipe and it's down below the water line and it's sticking way down there about an inch or an inch and a half, that could act as a siphon and that will actually start draining water out of your tank. Did you know that? Yeah, I've seen it happen. So if you've got the old style, check that out too. And if you don't have a little S hook, you may have to make one out of a, out of a paper clip or something like that so that you can hook it onto the side because you don't want this just pooched way down into this drain pipe, okay? So check that out and that could be your reason why it's draining too.